I'm going to show you the best unlimited XP glitch in Cold War Zombies working after all of the patches and hotfixes in Season 5 Reloaded. You can do this glitch solo or with friends to get unlimited XP, weapon XP, and rank up your battle pass extremely easily because there's unlimited ammo in this spot. So I'm going to break everything down for you guys in this video. Really quick, do me a huge favor and check if you are subscribed to the channel because 86% of you guys watching this video are not subscribed. It's free. It takes half a second. So click that big red button and turn the bell notification on so you guys don't miss a future video just like this one. I was getting a lot of questions asking about this glitch, whether or not it was passed or not, especially after the video I uploaded the other day with the knife lunge. So in this video, I'm going to give you a full detailed guide of everything you're going to need. But at the end of the video, if you guys have any questions, leave them in the comment section below and I will do my best to help you guys out. First off, we are going to start with what could go wrong while doing this glitch and then I will show you how to do it. That way, if something happens, you guys will know exactly what's going on. Starting off, go to the apartment rooftop on Mauro de Toten and save a zombie at the end. I recommend you get stamina up as when doing this glitch it can shoot you over like this and kill you so stamina up will stop the fall damage you can also do the knife lunge and it won't shoot you high enough that's okay just go ahead and try again until you get the right launch you can even get the launch right but still miss your landing spot so be careful i recommend you keep this door closed and go open up the map through the quick revive way but it is still possible if you open this door so this is what it looks like if done correctly and I will slow this down so you can see exactly what I do. If you can afford it, then throw a decoy grenade on the back of this so the zombie stands right here where you see mine does. If you don't have a decoy grenade, then stand up next to this, let the zombie hit you and then climb up on top and then wait for the zombie to throw meat at you. Whilst the zombie is throwing meat at you, just drop back and sprint forward and knife. Try to copy my exact placement of my crosshairs to get the best launch. You will then shoot up into the air and you may have to mantle onto this ledge or you will just land on it. Carefully edge off of this barrier and drop down. There is a death barrier on top so you do have to be careful. You're going to land on this door and again I recommend you keep it closed. Look where I do and jump forward. From here you're just going to copy the path that I take over to this spot and crouch. Push up against this wall and now you're going to move over to the right until you hit the barrier. Then jump up and slightly move to the right onto that barrier. And from here you're just going to slowly edge around the corner into this little room. Be careful you don't fall off the side because you will die. Once in here, all you have to do is just jump up and hit your head on the map where I do and now everything will pile up there. The last time I uploaded this, people were asking how to get ammo and the ammo box is literally right there so all you have to do is jump up and buy more. Pay attention to the ammo that I have, just jump up and buy more. It may take a few tries but it is possible. If you guys have mule kick, then you can also pick up ammo drops above you for free ammo. After ending tormentor rounds, the max ammo will spawn below the map giving you ammo as well. Now everything on the map will pile up exactly where you jumped up and you can go for infinite rounds and get unlimited XP. You can have any perks you want so before getting to the glitch I recommend you guys get fully set up with all of your perks, get pack a punch guns and you can stay here forever and get unlimited amounts of XP. I also suggest getting shatter blast on your gun to wipe out waves very quickly and elemental pop will also help with this. Like I said in the beginning, your friends can do this with you as well, and it is possible on round one if you really wanted to do so. You can have any field upgrade you would like, so I recommend Ring of Fire to go through rounds even faster. In order to get out of the glitch, just switch classes to Aether Shroud Tier 3 and place your crosshairs like I do and use it and it'll shoot you out. Any questions you may still have, leave them in the comment section and I'll do my best to answer them all and help as much as I can. If you enjoyed this video, drop a like on it and if you don't want to miss any future videos like this one, hit the subscribe button with the bell notifications turned on and I'll see you guys later. Thank you so much for watching.